no it's a no for me you guys it's a no for me hey guys this is simone welcome back to my channel thanks so much for watching i am here with a hair review video so this is going to be my first impression on the queen style hair I got targeted by one of those Facebook ads and I was like, okay, 20 bucks for some Peruvian water wave hair. Like, let's just see if it's actually legit. It said it was synthetic and I'm like, you know, I've been seeing all these Amazon reviews and stuff for synthetic hair. So I'm like, let me just give it a try. So I kind of wanted to do a mini unboxing of what I, my first thoughts were of the hair and then later I will actually try to wear the hair so you can see exactly how it looks on me. But I will warn you, when I first kind of saw the hair, I was not happy. So without further ado, let's get into it. So it came in this package here from China. Wang, Wang Jingxi. I'm not really sure how to say it. I don't want to butcher it came in this package here. So let me just tell you exactly when I ordered it and when it came. On May 4th, I got the notification that it had shipped, or sorry, that we have, that the order was confirmed and um, it cost me $19.88 and the shipping was $5.99. So my total paid for it was $25.87 and doo -doo 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 -doo. okay and then it arrived on may 29th so about three weeks to get here to my house which i guess is not that bad if you're thinking about aliexpress hair or any hair from china it's really not that bad so i decided to order this way i got targeted like i said by these facebook ads and i just wanted to see what was up with it so let's get into the unboxing it came in here little silver package. I already opened it. I couldn't wait. Came in this plastic bag. It was one long kind of thing. A little skeptical because the bag was really small and thin. So I was like, mm. so I, it comes in a little hairnet. hair net right here and here is the hair so I can already tell off the bat that the hair is pretty tangled it's really it actually is pretty soft it actually looks pretty shiny but it's not like a really bad shiny and then taking a look at the part, this is the part. Whoa, you guys, the part is mad plastic. It is plastico. <laughs> like, let me give you guys a close up of it. Whoa, it's it's super plasticky. It doesn't look like real scalp. Like, it's super white, which is funny because I feel like, well, I know that mostly us black folk we were in the wigs and so you would think that you would make it a little bit like more natural looking but it doesn't look natural um we got a little shedding i want to take an up close look at the actual part itself and kind of like if it's lace it's not a full, it says it's a full lace wig you can see the middle, it's like kind of like a mesh cap. I don't know if I would call this a lace cap. It's like a very rough kind of thing. I'm thinking I can wear this as a half wig. So this is the hairline. You can see that, I mean, there's not really much of a hairline. Like actually, when you look at it, it's kind of scary. <laughs> it's it's honestly kind of scary because look, if you put the hair up like this, there's a whole section right here where there's no hair. 
So there's no partying over the side, little side part, like there's none of that. There's a middle part or there's death. Like there's, there's nothing that will hide this, you know, the lack of hair there. I would say density wise, ooh, it's hard to say, but you can definitely see through it. You can see my face through it. Um, I'd be a little bit nervous wearing, especially this kind of thing to work, because people would be like, what, your hair? Um, maybe for a weekend brunch or something. I definitely don't think I can wear this as like a regular wig, like as is, just because of how weird the lace is. But either way, we're gonna try it and see what it looks like on my head. I don't think this is big head friendly. I have a huge head. I also have a lot of hair on top of that. So let's try and see what it looks like with my hair. Okay, you guys, <laughs> you definitely cannot wear this thing right out of the bag. I don't honestly know if this thing is wearable in general. This is crazy. This is exi this is not at all what it looked like. Let me see if I can pull up a picture. They obviously stole someone's picture from the from some other website, but this is terrible. This is so bad. Here's my here's my hot sale Peruvian water wave. This is what it looks like in the picture. This is what it looks like on me. Um, yikes. Yeah, there's definitely no baby hairs. There's definitely not a super great defined part. Um, yeah, no lace front at all. I mean, maybe I can curl this hair. The weird thing is the, the curl pattern is trash. Like, it's, yikes. Like, I don't even know what I'm supposed to be doing with this, to be honest, because it's just like, uh. <laughs> I do want to show you guys how long it is, though. It's pretty long. It said it was 22 inches. Another thing about this wig is that they didn't give any instructions. They didn't say if it was heat safe. They didn't say if it was, you know, synthetic or regular. Like, what if I forgot? It said, I remember when I first got it, that it was synthetic. But, like, I don't know if I could put heat in it. Like, what temperature I could put the heat at. So, yeah. Like, this is, I'm going to have to, I don't know how I'm going to finesse. I don't know how I'm going to finesse this but I need to finesse it. So the bottom line is, it's a scam. Don't order a, don't order hair from Queen Style Wigs. Like, I don't know what I was thinking. I just thought, oh, this will be fun to order something from online. Um, they steal people's pictures, obviously. This is not the hair that was advertised and like, I'm out here looking like a fool. So if you guys know what's good for you, like, do not order from this company. Like, maybe their straight hair is better, but I have a feeling it's the same weirdo plasticky thing. This is not big head friendly. Like, it's, my bun is like sticking out because it won't even, look at this, because it won't even cover my head. Yikes, I feel like Wednesday Adams. Like, no, this is not, this is not cute. So, if you guys, if you guys have ever ordered from Queen Style Wigs, comment below. Or if you've ordered from any of these Facebook wig companies, like let me know. 
Well, thank you guys so much for watching my channel and please come back again. I'll see if I can finesse this wig and actually make something of it. We'll see if we can curl it or do something with it. But right now, if it looks like this, it might have to go to the Goodwill pile. I don't know if Goodwill takes wigs, who knows, but I can't wear it. So it's gonna have to go somewhere and it's not gonna be at my house. So I hope you guys have a great day and I'll see you later. Bye. Um, yikes. So yeah, well, I gotta, I'll show you guys how I, I straighten it. Basically just take my flat iron. It's really, it gets really hot. There you go. Nice semi-silky straight hair. If I were doing it for real, for real, I would do it with a comb. No. It's a no for me, you guys. It's a no for me.